sing a little bit today. It's like this. Mighty, holy, worthy, so worthy.
concerts and if you know Out of Hiding, if you know Holy Fire Ministries at all, you know that, you know, entertainment's just not our thing. <laughs> We're just not interested. Um, but the passion of my heart, the thing that wakes me up in the morning, the thing that draws me here today to worship God is this burning desire that He wants to do more in our region, in this area, in New England, for the glory of God, that He wants to awaken the church and He wants to awaken the world to the things of God and to the victory of Jesus. And uh, as I began to cry out to God, I felt like today, right here, right now, the Holy Spirit just kept reminding me of 2 Corinthians chapter 6. And in the Bible, if you know that passage, it says uh, in verse 2, it says, Behold, now is the day of salvation. Behold, now is the time. And he goes on and on and he keeps on talking about how he gives no offense, but that he knows that now is the time of breakthrough. And I felt like in my heart what the Holy Spirit was pushing me to tell us all today was that there's many of us here today that you've had an issue, a bondage, a struggle, a fear in your heart, in your life a sickness, something that's been holding you back, something that's been a, a bondage in your life. And I feel like God is saying, if we would just reach out to him right now, there is an anointing here to break through. desire for you. God, a, a faith to believe in the miraculous, a faith to believe in breakthrough for our family and our friends and our region. Begin to stir our hearts right now, God. In Jesus' name, begin to stir our hearts, I pray. Come, Holy Spirit. 